Avengers game was based off of the book, more so than the movie in this case, because I read the book a long time ago. But it's a giant clear sphere. Um, I'll actually go ahead and do this. It'll take me a second though. Um, so it's it's a player based game. There's no uh, cores or anything like that allowed. And if you look, you might notice that there is a a whole bunch of stuff docked to the sides. Yes. Those are ob obstacles slash cover. So what happens is the pulsators in this launch them. Right. Because it's fun. <coughs> so what, do, um, you say, do you say undock all and hit the pulsator and it just goes nuts in there or something? Bingo. Right. And oh, okay. I'm Hello, reducing everybody. the number of pulsa pulsators again. Hello. Because uh, we learned last time that there were too many of them. Mm. So I'm going to reduce those really quick and then I'll launch these off. Oh, excellent. Takes a little bit of finesse to do it properly. Yeah, no worries, mate. Take your time. There you it's go. It's been about eight um, years. <laughs> so you're going to have, there are two little chambers, a red and a blue, and they and you have the teams on opposite sides. When the game starts, you hit open all doors, and then they go out and they beat the ever-living crap out of each other. Um, and the way to win in this one, because it supports a lower number of players, uh, is to get one team member through the door instead of, the book, it's, I think, five you need. So go ahead and close yeah, up that door. Here we go. Mm. Do not bump, bump the station for no, the no, love no. of God. I'm far away. It is, it's actually a ship, so. Yeah. Oh, you. Oh, no oh, way. Okay. <laughs> this is what the landing sphere originally was. <laughs> Three, two, one. Oh, oh God. Wow, that oh, looks God. so impressive. I was, I and that's how you do it. Door. it was That'll like... randomize everything so that the cover is all randomized. There's no way to win or to to be, you know, awesome. Each uh, piece of cover has power blocks and shield blocks, so you can't break them. You oh, and you can ride these around too to speed yourself up. <clears throat> well, they're gonna slow way down. Eventually, uh, yeah, but in yeah. the early game you can. Yeah, I guess. Uh, yeah, so that's the basis of it. That's amazing. I love it. Yeah, someone get in here with me. Yeah. That is awesome. It looks a lot better now. This is... Yeah. No. This, and then you, this is a proper murderplex. And then this you fly around... Yeah, then you fly around in astronaut mode, yeah? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Beautiful. And either take out the enemy team, or get a player through the opponent's door and close it. The way, the way that it works is that you get certain points of shooting out the player or win the whole game by passing through the enemy gate. Yeah, but oh, so it's I, just one just, person I to simplified win. it, trust me. Make it, okay. I yeah, simplified it's, it, it's just either eliminate the enemy team or get through the, the door. Okay, what size of teams are we looking at here? Uh, this supports up to 16 on 16. Wow, wow okay. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. The average this is not nice. players. Yeah, exactly. This is, oh my god. <laughs> yeah, this sphere is, um, it, yeah, this is really disorienting compared to it what I'm used to. It is so hard to tell There's just nothing to use as reference, I mean. Help, I'm getting out of there. I'm just gonna face into the wall here. It looks cool though, right? Oh yeah. Oh, this, this is really awesome. Bunch of spheres everywhere, why not? Exactly, who said you had to be a hexagon? <laughs> I want to be Dodecagon, thanks. Dodecagon. 